Goose's reign is over. Now, I am the ruler of Fairy Tale Kingdom, along with all its riches. Festive greetings, King Cole. Tomorrow is Christmas, but your subjects don't have money to buy presents for their friends and families. Please, Your Majesty, could you reduce the taxes? Reduce the taxes? <laughs> uh, I'd rather cancel Christmas. In fact, consider it cancelled. Guards, take him away. Hello, old friend. Remember me? I'm Humpty Dumpty from Mother Goose's Rhymes. I've come all the way from the fairy tale kingdom. You see, Mother Goose is missing, and King Cole has forbidden us from celebrating Christmas. Only someone with a pure soul can enter our kingdom, so we need your help. What do you say? Will you help us save Christmas? So this is the fairy tale kingdom. Uh-oh, looks like Humpty is about to fall down. Again. Oh my, I'm stuck. Um, can you help me down? I'll introduce you to everyone if you do. Here, take this. Now hurry, I can't hold on forever. We ravens serve King Cole the Great. We protect him from invaders and rebels. Leave now, or you'll spend Christmas in prison. Are you? You can't come in. We're conducting an investigation. Now leave. The fairy tale residents worked hard to prepare for Mother Goose's Christmas visit. Diddle Cat played his violin, while the three blind mice wrapped presents. Humpty Dumpty even decorated a chimney. Meanwhile, King Cole got thirsty for gold. His soul turned black with avarice, and one day he took his quill and issued an order prohibiting Christmas. 
The king ordered the king's men to take everything from Jill, Diddlecat, Humpty Dumpty, and other citizens by force. Only Mother Goose could have stopped this injustice and save Christmas. safe and sound thanks to you. Now, let's go. That building is our headquarters, where we've been coordinating our search for Mother Goose. With you helping us, we'll definitely find Mother Goose and save Christmas. Here, you'll need this. Huh? That's him, the traitor! Catch him! Oh no! Please, find Mother Goose! She's the only one who can stop King Cole and save Christmas! I hope Humpty escapes those guards. Meanwhile, I'll try to sneak into their headquarters. Hello? Please, open the door from the outside. The code is purity, love, joy, and happiness. Please hurry, I'm in trouble in here. Jill. I didn't think I'd see anyone outside when it's this cold. I just saw the King's men chasing Humpty Dumpty. I'll help you enter the headquarters if you bring me something warm to drink. If it's not too much trouble, I could use some honey tea to soothe my sore throat. Here, I even have some honey with me. Thank you. This is delicious. Wait, I know you. You're my favorite reader. I remember one day you kept flipping the page back and forth to make Jack roll up and down the hill. Unfortunately, Jack is working for King Cole now. But with you here, there's hope. 
I know you'll find Mother Goose and save Christmas. My poor feet have been freezing since the King's men stole my boots. If you can find me some new boots, I'll come with you. Oh, and uh, take this. It'll help you enter our headquarters. Wait, is this the Crooked Man? I've got to save him. Beautiful! This is the best Christmas present ever! If you want to put out that fire, you'll need the endless water from Jack's pail. I'll show you the way. Mother Goose created our fairy tale world, including this magical forest. It's full of wonders and many friendly creatures. If you assemble the snowflake, it'll show us the way.
but we haven't seen Mother Goose since last winter. We searched for her here, but found no trace. Where should we go next? Then King Cole took over, increasing our taxes and using his king's men to enforce them. Many creatures fled into this forest to escape their cruelty. Which path is the right? go. This is Jack's pail of endless water. I'm entrusting it to you. Good luck. Hello. <coughs> I am the crooked man. The king's men knocked over a lamp and everything caught fire. I was trying to escape when this heavy beam fell on me. My back feels badly hurt. Please, can you lift this thing off of me? I cannot move this beam. If you help me, I'll help you contact Mother Goose.
residents of Fairy Tales searched for Mother Goose. First, they checked Old MacDonald's farm. Diddle Cat investigated the Swan Lake. They even searched the kindergarten, but the children said she hadn't visited, even though they made presents for her. Diddle Cat, who often played music in the market square, reported he hadn't seen Mother Goose either. Jill suggested that Mother Goose could be buying presents at the Crooked Boots shoe shop. The three blind mice even risked their lives by searching the dark bat's cave. Humpty Dumpty even ex the three blind mice searched the magical forest, searching every everyone rushed to the winter garden, hoping to find Mother Goose strolling there. Humpty Dumpty's house, decorated with wreaths and garlands, was also empty. Jill remembered that Mother Goose loved to feed the ponies at Dipple Gray's stables for Christmas. Soon, they had searched the whole fairy kingdom, except for Old King Cole's castle. His guards wouldn't let them in. Is it Christmas already? What? No more Christmas? Not on my watch. Sure, I'll help you save the crooked man. He's always been kind to me. Take me with you, and take this hat too. You're gonna catch a cold otherwise. Thank you. Some people are put off by my dark clothes and my name itself, but looks are often deceiving. Though my name carries a bad reputation in your world, I love helping people here. Every Christmas, I give presents to all the children of Fairy Tale. The King's men came to arrest everyone, but I helped them escape in my secret passage. The King's men also broke Mother Goose's amulet, but I have all the shards. Take them. If you can restore it, you can contact Mother Goose.
worked! Mother Goose must have remembered us! I'm certain this portal leads to her. Soon everything will be back to normal. Hello, dear reader. I'm afraid I'm in trouble. I've been captured and the people are in danger. My fairy tale kingdom needs me. Well, I don't know where I am, but the three blind mice can help you find the way to me. Uh, this portal will take you to them. This ridiculous search for Mother Goose has gone on long enough. Now there's a human here trying to bring back Christmas. Gather all the mice and find that human. Otherwise, you'll all be eating breadcrumbs for Christmas dinner. As for you, I'll be taking these in payment. How could King Cole do that to him? What happened to his merry old soul? Hello, I'm Diddlecat. I was so happy to hear that my rhyme led you to buy a violin of your very own. But you must be careful. King Cole is hunting for you. After Mother Goose disappeared, he became cruel and increased our taxes. I can't even buy Christmas gifts for my kittens. The three blind mice can help you. They're nimble and can sneak anywhere. I can usually summon them with my violin, but you saw what happened. Could you find me another violin?
Run away from me, you scoundrel! King Cole promised a good reward for you! I've got to save Doc, or we'll never find Mother Goose. I'll get you one way or another! Wow, thank you so much. I'm going to play the mice's favorite song, and they'll be here in the twinkle of an eye. Thank you. 
I thought I recognized your voice. Your laughter has been the sweetest sound to our ears. Thank you for coming to Fairy Tale to help us. We love to help, but we can't go anywhere without our older brother, Doc. He's the leader of our trio. You saw the King's men chasing him? Then we must surely save Doc. Before we go, take these. They'll help in the shop. You'll need to help him before the guards capture him! Please, stop the guard! We'll go look for some help! The fairy tale kingdom is full of magic and wonder. 
Most of it is filled with light magic, helping everyone live in peace. But there are also places where darker magic dwells. No one is beyond temptation. Even the kings, with all their power and wealth, can fall prey to dark magic. King Cole was no exception. King Cole was cursed with greed. His desire for gold consumed his mind and soul, and the kingdom suffered for it. However, there is a way to break his curse. Thanks. I looked all over the kingdom, but I couldn't find any trace of Mother Goose. The only place I couldn't look was King Cole's castle. That's why one of his men was chasing me. Pretty suspicious if you ask me. Take this. You'll need it. You think you're pretty clever, do you? When King Cole hears what you've done, you'll vanish forever, just like Mother Goose! So King Cole kidnapped Mother Goose. That guard might know where she is, but I doubt he'll tell us. We could make him tell us with a truth potion, though. Here, I hope this helps you.
I saw Mother Goose in King Cole's dungeon. He took her because she was so kind and gave away her wealth to everyone in Fairy Tale. I miss Christmas too, to be honest. Only the horses of the King's men are allowed in the castle, so you'll need to take my horse. This will help you tame it. I've been expecting you. My ravens told me you're here to free that wretched Mother Goose. I'll never let her go. Guards! Imprison this traitor! No one. Not even Mother Goose herself shall steal my power and riches! I'll hide her where no one will ever find her. And you? <laughs> You're just a tasty snap for my rats. <laughs> escape and free Mother Goose.
still remember that day. It was Christmas, and everyone was busy watching our annual fireworks display. King Cole kidnapped me and locked me in this gloomy cell. He's too cruel to my residents, and I can't help them. If only I had my book, then I could put an end to all this. Hello! Sorry to see you're stuck here too, but we have good news. We know where the door seal is. We heard the Mouse King bragging that he had it, but he'll do anything for a nice piece of cheese. If you help us out here, we'll get it for you. Thank you. Wait here. We'll get the door sealed for you.
Here, take it. Let's go to the city and stop King Cole. to hide quickly it's time to gather taxes from the town but this time take everything from them their rebellion must be punished. Meanwhile, I'm going to Old MacDonald's farm to take Mother Goose's book of rhymes. Then, I'll have even more power! Hi, I'm Jack, Jill's twin brother. I'm glad you're here. Maybe you can help us bust out of here. I'd help you, but I'm so tired. King Cole's been making me work day and night, and I haven't had any food today. Do you have anything to eat? What are you doing here? I'll tell King Cole that you escaped. Unless, that is, you give me something in return. Come! with her always sunny smile, visited me for a cup of tea today. She asked me to decorate the Christmas tree and prepare the presents. But they were so expensive. They left a huge donut hole in my vault. Some mice have even moved in. I now lack the coins to maintain my castle. Christmas must be cancelled. My guards cut the finest fir tree with their axes to fuel the bonfire. Soon, my loyal ravens will fly around the kingdom to gather taxes, even from that lazy farmer, old MacDonald.
Thanks. I feel better already. King Cole is afraid of Mother Goose. She created this whole kingdom, so she could easily change everything, even him. She writes all of her stories in her special book, so King Cole has been trying to find it. I bet old MacDonald knows where it is, because he's Mother Goose's best friend. If you find her book of rhymes, you can save Christmas. You can use my dog sled, but they'll have to trust you first. Here, you can have my all too. It's old McDonald's farm. Wait, isn't that Mother Goose's carriage? Thank goodness, but I'm afraid we don't have much time. You must find my book of rhymes before King Cole does. I've hidden it in the clock on old McDonald's farm. Find it and rewrite our story. Oh, here, your hand looks cold, dearie. As punishment for your lies, I order your barn to be burned to the ground! Your Majesty, please, I'm not lying. This barn is full of supplies for winter. I don't know where Mother Goose's Book of Rhymes is. Not only that, but you've covered your farm in decorations as well! <laughs> you know Christmas is forbidden! This is for your own good, MacDonald. Burn it! My farm! No! Hello. The 
The name's MacDonald, and I owned this barn until King Cole's men set it ablaze. Now I'm ruined. My barn was full of supplies for the town, but my favorite pig, Petey, is trapped inside, too. My hands won't stop trembling. If you save my barn, I'll help you find Mother Goose's book.
did it! I've got to see if Petey is okay. Petey, wait! Oh no, he's run off! Poor Petey must have been scared half to death by that fire. Did you see where he went? We've got to find him. I'm too old to chase him down in this cold weather. Can you find him? You see the key to finding Mother Goose's book is around his neck. Her book is the only way to stop King Cole and save Christmas. Here, take this. I'll wait for you in the farmhouse.
You found him. Thank you. Here, this weight is what will open my clock. That's where we hid Mother Goose's book. What the? Where's her book? Wait, there's a note here. Shoot, I can't read it without my bifocals. Here. Dear McDonald, I'm really sorry for stealing Mother Goose's book, but I'm gonna rewrite it and save Christmas. I hope you're not angry. Love, Nigel. Oh, Nigel. That little one is always causing mischief. He lives with his Aunt Polly up on the hill. You'd better find that book before he rewrites us all. I have a pair of skis, but they've seen better days. You're welcome to them, though. Hello, I'm Polly. Have you seen my little Nigel? Oh dear, I'm so sorry he stole her book. He was so upset when he learned Christmas was cancelled. I haven't seen him since he ran off to confront King Cole. Did you really think you were a match for the wise King Cole? Foolish boy. Nigel, wake up. He always was a heavy sleeper, but I'm afraid this sleep is magical. I know a way we can enter his dreams, but we'll need some ingredients. Maybe his dream can help us find Mother Goose's book. Where is the boy who looks after the sheep? He's under the snow, fast asleep. That's mine. I can't just give it away. Thank you. 
That's mine. King Cole canceled Christmas? Well, I couldn't just let that happen, so I decided to bring everyone presents in secret! Oh, but these chimneys are so dirty, I'm covered in soot. Do you have some water so I could wash myself? I'll give you a present if you do. I miss Mother Goose. She's so nice. She always gave me candy. But then King Cole kidnapped her. I wish I had a sword to fight him. He's just a timid bunny, always hiding behind his king's men. Then he canceled Christmas. I already bought presents and was looking forward to milk and cookies, sledding, and snowball fights. The best part is Christmas Eve, when Aunt Polly tells us fairy tales. My friends and I stole Mother Goose's book from Old MacDonald to save her, but King Cole found us somehow and caught us. I ran away and lost my hat, but King Cole forced my friends to count his gold and diamonds. Thanks for waking me up! Unfortunately, I don't have Mother Goose's book anymore. I bet it fell out when I landed into that pile of snow. That book is our only chance to rewrite this story. All I have is this broken ornament. It's really sharp, but I hope it helps you. Nigel, you'll catch a cold if you stay out here any longer. Now go in and warm up. We'll rescue your friends. I promise. Did you find my bag? Have you seen my seven league boots? I can't get home without them. If you find them, I'll give you something useful in return.
Thank you. Here's some presents for you. Merry Christmas. is a sign of my uh, gratitude. Merry Christmas. Now, if uh, you'll excuse me, I won't let King Cole deprive the residents uh, of this happy holiday. My bag! Thank you! Here's Mother Goose's book, but it's locked. Some parts are missing. If you find them, we can unlock it together. All right, you found the missing parts. Now let's unlock the book.
done so well, but you'll need my magical quill and ink to rewrite this story. They're in my workshop. Luckily, I know where Mother Goose's workshop is. I visited her on Christmas two years ago. It's far away, but we have a balloon in the backyard that could get us there quickly. If you find the magical fuel for it, we can leave immediately.
My seven league boots! I'll make it home for Christmas after all. Here, a Christmas gift for you.
No one to stand around! Gather all the gold from the townspeople, now! You again? Well, you're too late. I have a page from Mother Goose's book. That's more than enough to give me endless gold and to erase you from this story forever. This should keep you out of my way. Now, get lost! If he thinks I'll ever give up, he's mistaken. Have you seen my husband? He went to buy Christmas presents a few days ago, but he hasn't returned. I'm so lonely without him. If you find him, I'll even give you a gift. You. These are for you. Merry Christmas.
with such a persistent pest. Let's see how you handle this. Urgh! This isn't over. I'll save Mother Goose and Christmas, no matter what.
she lost her shoe while fleeing the ball, but the prince found her anyway. Her mother asked her to bring treats to her grandmother, but she met a clever wolf in the woods who tried to trick her. She was cursed to sleep forever after pricking her finger on a spinning wheel, but a prince's kiss broke the spell. A young man inherited a cat from his father. The cat asked only for a pair of fine boots and made his master famous. He was a rich man who let his wife go wherever she wished, except for one room. When she disobeyed, she found his terrible secret. I need more. More gold! I order you to rewrite this story! Make me the richest man in fairy tale world! Your greed can never be satisfied. Can't you see that your subjects are suffering? Besides, I can't write a magical story with just any ink. Only magical ink will do. It's you! For once, I actually need you! Bring me the magical ink, now! If you don't, I'll kill Mother Goose.
What's going on? You lied to me, Mother Goose. Explain yourself! No, King Cole. It was your anger and greed that tainted my magical ink. No fairy tale can be penned with wicked ink like this. How dare you! I am the Merry King Cole, and I have always been happy! You... I'm losing my patience! Bring me magical ink, now! Dear friend, I would like you to write for the king. Oh, I'm certain you'll make the right decision. King Cole's dream finally came true. He had all the gold in the world, but he wasn't truly happy. Even all the gold was not enough. Suddenly, all his gold turned into piles of black, dull coal. What are you doing? Stop that! You're ruining my story!
What came over me? I, why would I cancel Christmas? It's my favorite holiday too. Please, you must forgive me. My greed overcame me and clouded my judgment. I never meant to hurt anyone or Christmas. I must make this right. I shall organize the largest celebration ever. There shall be food and presents for everyone in the entire fairy tale kingdom. Thank you for saving us all, my dear reader. Now you must return, so you may celebrate the holidays in your world. Farewell and Merry Christmas. <laughs>